Welcome back to another MySys video with Brandout Consulting. Today we're going to be talking about creating a PO. So we go to purchasing, we come over here to new PO. Our PO number here is going to be auto populated. If you want to change it, you can, but it's going to just go in order from how you've put it before. So uh, here under job, under new job, supplier number. We're going to select our supplier here. Everything in gray is going to be auto populated. When we select this box and we come down here to add new line, all of the qualified items from this supplier is going to be right here. So we come here and we hit select. Now, one of the things that we have to pay attention to is during our supplier setup, we set up how many of this item is converted so each case is a thousand right here so each case is a thousand so we come over here and if we're trying to order 10,000 today we need to order 10 cases so we need to pay attention very closely to our conversion factor and what that will do is that will multiply out our extended price and our weight Alright, so that's all we're going to do for this particular PO. So now we're going to hit save up here. We can open the PO. And as soon as you open the PO, it's going to allow you to make changes. This is when you go through your approval processes. So we're going to go ahead and open that PO. Close it. And when we are ready to send it to our vendor, we come down here, we select it. It's opened up. We can come over here to send PO. After ensuring everything's right, we click on that. And we can send this email out. All right. And that's all it is to send that PO. Our next video will be expediting a PO and receiving a PO. If this has been helpful, remember to like, share, subscribe, and comment below. Let us know if there's anything else we can do for you. Thanks.